Gonna dance out for ya It go like Boom, 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 boom. Sudden we so great All of a sudden they not safe Look We just want some teams Don't want no fights Don't come around If you can avoid See me swerving I'm accustomed to the right Vroom vroom We don't want to slow the grind These days I'm in the shops like Do you have my size in them? I don't want to try them on bitch I got my eyes in them I'm over window shopping now I feel like buying them I'm saying fuck her up We could never ride with them Hey sir, I ain't really see shit get sticky They can run up in your house with no mask, no blicky Used to stay up on the corners with my bros Yeah, still a hustle tryna make it for my folk I'm talking about my mom to them Never had a father them Never had no one to look up to Never had a brother them Jiminy, Jiminy, Jiminy Pops is probably cool I cannot blame a nigga, he a fucking fool This is all insane We some mates All of a sudden we so great all of a sudden, then I safe. Look, we just want some teams. Don't want no fights. Don't come around if you can avoid. See me swerving, I'm accustomed to the right. Vroom, vroom, we don't want to. Alright, legends, so I hope you liked that first part of the video. Um, I'm going to plug my friend Jaden, who took all that footage um, that you've seen so far in the video with his pretty mint A7 III Sony camera. So you'll notice. There's a big downgrade to my camera setup um, <clears throat> for this last clip, but I'm going to plug this man's um, Instagram and stuff here. He's just getting into some content creation and he has a big future ahead. And um, I'm pretty lucky to be able to get some content from him lately and um, show him the ropes in a way with some, th some things as well. So just to finish off this video, I thought it'd be a good topic to talk about work productivity. Now, obviously you guys know that I'm a full-time personal trainer and I run JV Bread on the side and then obviously a few other things that come along with that. And um, obviously for me, time management is absolutely crucial. It's something that I've never been amazing at either, surprisingly. Um, and it's something that I've had to work really hard at. Most of the things that um, I deal with in my in my job and my businesses come pretty natural to me. Um, but time management is definitely not one. I'm one of those people who always strives to do more, 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 and trying to balance that out can be tough, right? So I wanna talk about a, a kind of method that I use called the work reward system, right? Well, I call it that anyway, it's the work reward system. So for me, um, I have to have my escapes. Now, my two main escapes are training, obviously, and playing golf or any type of sport. Um, and then the third one is probably just hanging out with friends, right? So I have to have an escape. And for me, 
to uh, be my best when I am working, I need to make sure that I'm um, utilizing you know, my, my escapes, right? And spending enough time on them. So what I do is I always set a goal, whether that's a certain amount of hours worked or a certain amount of tasks completed before I take my reward. So my reward might be going out for a round of golf, which lately that's pretty much what it's been. I fucking love my golf. Um, it might be to go train. Um, it might be to catch up and uh, see some of my friends or go for a drink with my friends because I'm in off season. Um, or, you know, it could be anything like going for a walk, going to the shops, like anything, right? But I always make a promise with myself that I won't go do that, that thing until I finish my work. Now, it sounds so simple, but it sounds so simple, but if you apply it correctly, it can make the world a difference because there's two ways to go about it. If you have too much rewards, so too much playtime, not enough work, obviously you're not gonna get the task done that you need. You're gonna probably hit the bare minimum of what you need to do and you're not gonna get better. Now obviously, this applies for everything. This applies for your nine to five job that you're working if you wanna work up the ranks, right? It applies to if you run a business and you want your business to grow. It applies to if you wanna build your dream physique but you're not putting in the work. So if, obviously if you're not gonna do enough work, you're not gonna see the rewards. But on the other hand, which I've experienced before, is that if you're not doing enough reward and you're not spending enough time on the things that you love to do, right, you're gonna find a decrease in productivity. And I tell you right now, you cannot just work, 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 work. Um, I've fallen into that trap. One of my favorite mentors is Gary V. Gary V has this mindset, but I've learned in as time's gone on that you have to have that balance, right? So, this is my biggest tip to you guys, is make sure that you make promises with yourself that you won't break in regards to work expectations, and then re go reward yourself now, right? Now, with the reward as well, you don't want it to be anything too far out of the scope. You don't want to be going fucking on a three-day bender as a reward, or you don't want to be blowing five, five hundred, one thousand dollars on, you know, something that you don't actually need. Like, be careful with the reward as well. But that's probably my biggest tip in regards to work productivity because you will be more productive in the times that you are that you are um, working. So thank you so much for tuning into the first video. I want to kind of set out like this, do a bit of a workout, do a bit of a talk to you guys, take you guys along the ride. We're just about to have a bread, another massive bread launch. I'm just about to start prep. Business is growing, so. What a perfect time to start documenting what's going on. So thank you so much for tuning in. Make sure you like and subscribe to the video. Share it around. Share it on Instagram. It means the world to me. You're going to have loads more um, content, informative content coming away. Love you all. See you next time.